President of the Sheep and Goat Farmers Association, Shiraz Khan, is calling on the Ministry of Agriculture to address issues at the Aripo Breeding Center. Mr. Khan explains for the past few weeks, farmers have been facing difficulty getting their animals artificially inseminated due to faulty equipment at the center. They are claims that they, are, and they have no equipment, which is pipettes, syringes, gloves, and the whole apparatus that we need to get the AI done. They have none in stock, and they don't seem to be getting any until after budget is passed. Additionally, the animals are not being fed properly to extract semen from them because it means that they have no money. Mr. Khan is calling on the ministry to address the issue as he believes the agriculture sector is again being neglected. Is it that the Ministry of Agriculture is, is looking to destroy the livestock section in this country? And additionally, we are demanding from the Minister of Agriculture at this point in time to fix things for us because we, the livestock farmers, are already operating on a tremendous difficulty. And it's only fitting that he can ensure that the farmers and them animals are bred in time and being bred with healthy semen that will produce healthy offspring and we could continue in our production. Meanwhile, Minister of Agriculture, Land and Fisheries, Clarence Rambarat, says he's aware of the issues at the Aripo Breeding Center. That, that, um, the complaint has been brought to me and I've asked the ministry to look at it, but there are problems, there are challenges throughout the livestock operations in the ministry, and that is the reason we commissioned a consultant, Dr. Knights, and I've spoken about this in the past. Dr. Knights was commissioned, he's a Trinidadian working in Virginia. He's very familiar with our, um, the ministry and livestock industry in Trinidad. He's given us a report and we intend in the next year to implement the recommendations of the, of the report. The minister said the report had highlighted several issues plaguing the ministry. In some instances we have uh, a low level of training, we have to improve the training. And in some instances we uh, have areas that are not productive enough and we have to make decisions on whether we want to continue in those areas. And most importantly, what the ministry should be doing is exactly what Shiraz Khan is saying. We should be focusing on the farmers and we should be reducing what we're doing in terms of having our own animals. We should be focusing on the animals and redirect the, the, the issue, the resources to the private farmers.